Hello guys, Mike here with 2 0 Scrapping. Today I'm going to be showing you the AP method of gold recovery. Um, we're going to do um, these pins that I've saved up. We'll measure them, see how much we're going to put in this jar here. Um, <clears throat> so let's get started. So we're going to turn this on. Oh, maybe I should have waited. Clear this. Alright. It's going to be a, maybe a few ounces. Not a lot. Probably gonna leave this piece off since it has some solder in it. It kind of messes up the solution a little bit. Okay. So we're gonna do 2.3 ounces. Okay. So we'll just get the jar. Throw them in there. Want them to be all flat, laying flat on there, so they can get the maximum exposure to the acid peroxide solution. Just pieces, just break them. Okay. More. Probably break this piece here. out of the way. Okay, what we're going to do, we're going to fill it up with, <coughs> with some muriatic acid. Um, this one is 32%. Let's see, where does it say that? Oh, um, well, almost 32%. It's 31.45%. Um, I got this at Home Depot. So you probably get them at Lowe's, any hardware store should have some of this. Um, always wear a mask when using this. The fumes are really toxic. So I'm gonna put on my mask right now and um, I wanna apologize if I sound a little bit like Darth Vader, but this is for my health and safety. So here we go. Alright, so we're going to put enough muriatic acid to cover the pins, I mean the, the fingers. So we're going to pour Okay. And you can see that it's barely covering it right here it's barely barely covering the gold fingers let me lower this camera so you can see a little better Let's zoom in okay I put just enough to where it covers the gold fingers. And now I'm gonna add some hydrogen peroxide. This is 3%. Well, I can't see that. It's a 3% hydrogen peroxide. So we're gonna open that up. And we're going to pour in just a little bit. Just enough to get the reaction started. And then we're going to give it a little shake. Oh. 
probably add a little bit more peroxide. Alright, that's good enough. Let me place this a little. Okay. Just give it a little shake. Get it all mixed up in there so the reaction can get going. Okay. We're gonna let this sit for a few days. So um, once I'll check every day, once a day, to make sure that the reaction is still working. If I need to add more acid or peroxide, I will. Um, and we'll just keep it outside we don't want to have this inside because the fumes are really hazardous and they sort of start to rust everything that's metal um, so you want to leave this outside somewhere safe where kids can get to it of course or your animals and pets um, I don't know if you can see the fumes coming out of it no, probably not. But yeah, this this is my technique here. I don't really have a measurement to how much I use. I just cover it um, with muriatic acid. Once it passes the fingers, then I add the peroxide a little bit at a time until I feel that I have added enough. And I just keep shaking it. As you can see it's already starting to turn green so it's already melting the, the base metals underneath the, the gold fingers there so yeah um, we'll check this every day until the foils come off and I'll keep you updated see how it's going I'm gonna put this outside now because I can't really breathe with this mask on Alright, thanks for watching, comment, like, subscribe, and I'll see you on the next video.